Hello, this is Bobby with Iconic Autos in sunny Scottsdale, Arizona. Today we have for you a really special treat. It's a 1959 Corvette Roadster. And this is a really, really nice 59 Corvette. Uh, as far as C1s go, uh, I see, you see them out there in a lot of various conditions. This is a really nice, basically untouched one for the most part, um, besides having some mechanical stuff done to it. Uh, this car, uh, the story on this car, it came out of Sacramento, California originally. It was a black plate California car. Uh, the gentleman I got it from, it's been his family since 1985. So one family owns for the past like nearly 40 years. Uh, his dad, father bought it and kept it and then he passed it on to him. Uh, it's the gentleman I got it from and I got it uh, from him. So I uh, just, just don't use the car very much. Uh, in, in about four or five years ago, he had the car mechanically completely gone through at a shop in town and spent nearly $50,000, uh, put a new engine, transmission, pulled the body off the frame, did everything mechanically, brakes, uh, everything mechanical. <laughs> like, uh, literally he pulled the body off the frame and did the frame. So rear end, brakes, suspension, uh, engine, uh, Tremec five speed in it. So it's got, it's got aluminum radiator. So it's got all the really the modern conveniences you'd want to, for to, an early Corvette to jump in and actually enjoy, but looks totally stock from the outside. Um, this car, believe it or not, is still the same paint head job it had since the 1980s and it's absolutely gorgeous. Uh, it's never been hit or hurt. It's all original body on the car. Uh, I know a lot of these cars have been hit and put together and pieced together. This is not one of those type of cars. This is a very, very well taken care of car. It's always been a nice car its entire life, which is very unusual. Uh, just look at the body on this car. Again, it is one of the nicest bodies I've seen on a, a C1, early C1 Corvette. All this chrome, again, he did not restore this car. This is the way he got it in 1985. So it's actually uh, unbelievable how well this car was taken care of. Uh, it looks like it was restored yesterday almost. All the trim just look at the stuff straight that bodies i've seen restored cars that don't look this nice look how nice the hubcaps are beautiful tires fit and finish is excellent if you want to nitpick there's one little dinger in the trim right there i'll show any imperfection in the car here as i go around it but look at the fit on that door it's really super nice car all the way around uh, beautiful glass the Glass rubber on the outside is aging a little bit. The rubber, uh, the only way to fix that is you have to pull the windshield out and replace that rubber, but it just the outside's cracking a little bit. You don't have to, I, I leave it alone, honestly. See the body on the back is absolutely gorgeous. All the chrome's beautiful, everything underneath is excellent. Fit on that trunk lid's perfect. It's a really, really quality car. It's a little age in the chrome on the door handle there. The car just shows wonderful. With the fit of the hood. Underneath. Excellent. Um, I'm guessing some of the interior is probably original, some was redone. I'm not sure. <laughs> it looks so nice. Again, this is how the car has been since 85 for sure. All the gauges are nice, steering wheel is nice, uh, all the gauges work. 
um, tech works, original radio works on it. You got a sticker there, I don't know if that's original. If not, you can see the Tremec 5 speed. dash pad a couple of imperfections like right here one little spot here and one spot here original door panels again I believe them uh, trunk is nice I had that open earlier original trunk mat just original spares in there you can see all the pictures of my ad. Nice uh, original uh, dash pad. Again, you put a new rubber in there, you get that underneath there. And that's probably the rubber there. I'm just going to show you guys everything. It's just super clean car overall. It's got seat belts. It's almost car just turnkey, drive, and enjoy. Sometimes you can get these cars too nice, you can't enjoy them. This was just like get the right amount of a little patina here and there. A little spot there where you don't have to worry about like being too perfect, but still gorgeous, you know. All the windows go up and down as they should. I got pictures of all that. Inside the trunk, uh, inside under the hood here, sorry. <laughs> nice and clean. Again, he's it's got a 383 stroker engine in it. The Luma radiator on a Tremec 5 speed, so it's got some nice get up and go and fun to drive. The serpentine belt system they put. And I know people are going to ask me the other original motor. I do not. That's the way I got it. <laughs> Carbureted. So nice, easy to fix, reliable. Let's give it. Start it up, take it for a spin.
where it's like totally stock it's got the stock feel and everything but it's like a lot reliable and fun to drive it's got good power you know and it still has that stock look which i like and feel you know not the total modern feel but i mean it is ready to go turnkey um don't wait on this one it's not gonna last long i mean this is a your Corvette nut, just come look at it. And tell me uh, what you think of the body on this thing because it's absolutely amazing. Um, but if you're not, you just want a clean red Corvette to cruise, this is the perfect car for you. It's like you just don't, don't take it and take it to the mechanic shop and get it sorted out and all that BS. Like it is literally ready to go. So, uh, any questions, call, email, text. Um, if you're in Scottsdale, you're more than welcome to come look at it or send someone to come look at it. And um, that is about it. Uh, thank you very much. This baby won't last long. And all the pictures, check them out. And you can see other video underneath. All the pictures are underneath.